Demonstrators gathered in New York City's Zuccotti Park on Saturday to celebrate the six-month anniversary of the Occupy Wall Street movement. Well, we're here in Zuccotti Park, which, remember, we renamed Liberty Square on the six-month anniversary of the day that we took this park for Occupy Wall Street, September 17, 2011. And it's also the beginning of spring, the American spring. And so we're here to reinvigorate Occupy, to re-energize, and to prepare for a big spring. Myself and many, many others have been working throughout the winter. And now that the weather is on our side, we're going to be out a lot more. It was a day filled with theatrics, art, and music. The gathering was followed by a massive march around the streets of downtown Manhattan with demonstrators chanting various slogans like, We got sold out, banks got bailed out. We got sold out. According to organizers, the march was aimed at raising public awareness about food and economic injustice in both the past and the present. National and international activists joined to remind skeptics that the movement is still alive and kicking. You can't arrest an idea, you can't barricade an idea, you can't even ignore an idea like this because it's in people's hearts and minds, it's never going to die. Participants noted that the winter months had given them the time and opportunity to plan future steps. We never left. We never died. We've been here. We've been in communities organizing. We've been saving people from foreclosure in their homes, helping schools and young people, and really taking the winter to re-energize. The event was also aimed at raising public awareness on food sustainability, housing, health care, and the economy. the demonstrations and gatherings in the next couple of months will focus on preparing for May Day, the day in which the occupiers hope to call for general strikes. Susan Madaris, Press TV, New York.